We begin this half hour with a rather strange and puzzling medical story. More than a dozen teenagers from the same school are suffering from the same problem. Physical twitches they can't control. Doctors say it is psychological. Their parents think it may be something else. As Michelle Miller reports, it is bringing big name attention to this town. In a small town in upstate New York, a group of local high school girls are making national headlines for what many are calling a medical mystery. I'm not good, not today. Hasn't been for a while. It, my text, my text got worse. Thera Sanchez and Lydia Parker are only two of more than a dozen girls who've been experiencing symptoms of uncontrollable tics and verbal outbursts. Uh. Thera's mom told CNN she brought her daughter to the hospital after she started involuntary ticking when she woke up from an afternoon nap. Since then, the numbers have grown to 15, and all of them, except one, are girls. To the north of us here. Over the weekend, the media craze surrounding the mystery grew when famous environmental activist Aaron Brockovich sent one of her investigators to look for possible environmental causes. The team tested local groundwater samples for chemicals that they believe may be left over from a 1970 train derailment that spilled thousands of gallons of industrial solvent. But both school and state health officials had already concluded a three-month investigation that determined no environmental or infectious agents could have caused the students' ticks. Instead, local doctors who have examined 11 of the teens have determined the girls have a stress-induced conversion disorder that starts as a mental or emotional crisis, a scary or stressful incident of some kind, and converts to a physical problem. But some parents refuse to accept that the causes are purely psychological. Even if it was conversion disorder and that was the symptoms of it, we don't know what caused it. In their minds, the small town medical mystery is still very much unsolved. For CBS This Morning, Michelle Miller, New York.